Alright, hey there gamers, so if you have a Viper two-way battery remote, I have the 7944V, um, and for some reason your screen won't come on, it just won't work, mine is now, but if for some reason, just out of the blue, you were using it and didn't drop it or anything, screen doesn't turn on anymore, charging it won't do anything, you might get some noises or lights from it when you click things, but nothing on the screen, the battery is screwed. And now it is a replaceable battery, but they don't want you to know that. So you're going to take a small, small Phillips screwdriver to here, take that out, then you're going to take a flathead and you're going to pry at the bottom till it pops out, then you're going to pry at the top, it's okay. There's enough room, you need a pretty small flathead you can see where i did it i already did it i'm just making this video as an fyi then once you pop this lid off it's uh it's nice and easy you'll get one of these batteries this is the old battery the crap battery i'm gonna throw it out but i thought i'd show it on the video so just get whatever one on amazon you want i'm gonna link the one that i used it's it's not this one once again this is the oem battery right here um so how many milliamp hours? 560 milliamp hours. The new one I got is 850. So either way, it's worth just throwing a new battery in because it's going to last longer than this one anyways. But yeah, this battery's crap. Would not work anymore. So just unplug it. The uh, You plug it in like you have it uh, like this. It, it, it sits like this. So in, inside the remote. Exactly. Let me show you like this so with the cover removed once again sorry too lazy but it'll just plug in right like that you might have to move it slightly left or right just take a flathead pop the old one off there's a bit of light glue underneath and then just screw it all together i uh, it was really difficult to get this pushed together so i literally just bit it together with my teeth and then it clipped in there with with the force and it all worked after um when i uh when i first screwed this in all the way this button was kind of stiff um, so I just kind of loosened out this screw a tiny, tiny bit, and these buttons all feel normal again. I have a silicone case coming to protect this uh, off Amazon. They didn't make them when I got this. I got this model when it, like, first came out. So, anyways, that's how you, uh, fix a Viper remote and save yourself, you know, 200 300 400 dollars, depending on your currency. I think it's, like, 400 kind of Canadian to get one of these, uh, because this is the current top-of-the-line model. So, yeah little 10 20 i think this was a 20 dollar battery from amazon i'll link it in the description um no affiliation no sponsor don't have to buy that one if you don't want it um but that's the one i had um have a great day thanks for watching